welcome back to my channel we are here with another video okay maybe i was being dramatic but hi today i'll be doing a video showing you guys how to meal prep if you want to maintain your weight um this particular video is not for weight loss but if you guys are interested in me doing a meal prep for weight loss be sure to let me know in the comments below and if you already not subscribed, make sure you subscribe and turn on your notification bell. And let's get started. Okay, so I like to do my vegetables first. So I'm just cutting up my peppers. Um, I try to get every color in the peppers. Honestly, it just makes it look pretty. Um, of course, they're still good. But I just like for my food to be a little colorful. It makes me more excited about eating it. Um, so I'm just cutting up my peppers, cutting up my garlic, and then also cutting up a little bit of onion as well. Okay, so I like to saute my peppers and onions in some extra virgin olive oil. I also use grass-fed butter. Um, I've been using this now since I did keto. Um, it's actually good. So I just saute that, uh, let it get a little hot, steamy, you know what I'm saying? And uh, then we're going to add our shrimp in a minute. So here is my raw, divine, divine, whatever, however you say it. <laughs> Tail is still on, but it's already shell off um, shrimp. Did I say raw already? Yeah, but anyway, it's raw shrimp. Um, I'm going ahead and season it with some garlic powder, some obey, pepper, parsley flakes. Um, also added in some paprika and a lemon juice. Mm, yeah. Okay, so now we are just adding in the shrimp with the peppers. Um, I added a little more obey because I didn't think it was enough. I like a lot of obey on my shrimp, y'all. I'm sorry, don't judge me. And then I also added a little more of the grass fed butters for more, um, you know what I'm saying? What, what is this? Y'all know, y'all know. Okay, so I don't know why I tried myself with these sweet potatoes. So I put these in the microwave. These are steamables. Um, I think it was for eight minutes, but. I tried to cut it right after it came out the microwave. How smart was that? I don't know. But guess what? Y'all gonna have to stand by for a little minute because I had to let them cool off. And then I'm gonna come back and cut them up and show y'all what I do with them. Okay, so I'm back from my lunch break. <laughs> nah, so I let them cool off a little bit. So now I'm just cutting them up in like circles uh, just to make it easier to mash together. I like mine's mashed. I don't care for them whole or in cubes i think it tastes better honestly when it's like mashed like mashed potatoes but really not mashed potatoes but you get the point and then i just add in some olive oil some grass fed butter again and then also add in some cinnamon for some flavor because your girl like a little bit of flavor oh grr.
so here we have our lean. I think it was 95% lean, 5% fat, ground turkey. Or was it chicken? I think it's ground turkey, if I'm not mistaken. But yeah, we just dicing that up, you know what I'm saying? Season it to your liking. Uh, I use Mrs. Dash. It's not too salty, you know, no MSG or nothing like that. So, yeah. Okay, so I didn't show the part, of course, where I put my veggies in the microwave. I'm all about time saving and making the best decisions possible. I don't, I mean, of course, we all know fresh vegetables is better, but this video is meant for you to make it in a certain amount of time because I know people be busy. So I went ahead and I microwave my cauliflower rice and then I also microwave my broccoli, the steamables. So here I'm just portioning it out, sectioning it off. Um, also sectioning off the shrimp and the peppers, also the ground turkey, and then um, distributing it evenly proportion in each bowl. So I got five here Monday through Friday, um, Saturday and Sunday. I usually don't really meal prep, honestly, to be real. I still eat right sometimes. I don't know. It depends if I want a Chick-fil-A sandwich, but y'all get the point. So I always usually add parsley flakes just to make my food look a little pretty. And yeah, that's about it, y'all. Okay, so here is the final look. I'm doing a little slow-mo, you know what I'm saying? Show the, the extraness. Yeah, so yeah, y'all, y'all should try these meals out. Meal prepping is the best thing you can do if you want to stay on track with your eating. Um, again, this is a maintaining video. I've been my size now for a little over a year. So if you like the video, make sure you like the video. Also subscribe, tell your friends, family, and also comment below if you want a meal prep video on weight loss. But yeah, if you're interested, let me know. Bye.